guys. Ah oh, well, I finally managed to the first tip out for the while. Aye, I'm off to the turn now and I'm off to the tune. Aye, before this setting off, aye, I spent so much time, but we spent nearly an hour making a decision on what to wear with this hoodie, so I've decided, decided to wear the jeans. Um, and I also spent the time debating on what to do for food, but I've decided um, I'm going to take bottles of water in my bag and because I need water to keep me happy otherwise I do get thirsty quite easily to those who know me personally will know um, and obviously I'm going to grab food up in the old castle Ah well, just be made like a portion of chips and as soon as I finished I felt like I could um, eat more if you know what I mean and like I just left it for a bit and like felt for me like sometimes I wonder how on earth could I actually eat so much Aye, we've just been in for JD here. Aye, to be honest, it's the biggest of a JD um, I've ever seen. Like, um, the trainers are the whole floor of our size of your average shop at um, High Street store. This block's rather colourful. Vision. No, yeah, I've actually now found, yes this is where I want to be, I've now found the road of the directions I was meant to be going. Oh, no, I'm not meant to walk further this way. Beauty of um, the sat nav. I don't know what I'd do without a sat-nav on your phone. Well, I've found the destination at least. It's like a maze around here. Wouldn't even have a tour when get back out. So I could be stuck in Newcastle. Ah, it says, exhibition continues, but it's nothing. Um. Don't know how well you can see it due to the quality of the windows hiding it by St James's Park. Some big head vat. Ah oh, well, it's nearly like a mini day out trip to London is. All the things are the good, and all the things you don't have planned. Aye, I was coming to Newcastle thinking it would have just been my normal walk around the city centre and um, I'm on these bit. 
there's their big clock cathedral thing, whatever on earth it is. Um, but yeah, uh, it was really good at um, fine art exhibition. I, mean, I was at um, Newcastle Uni. Um, aye, of course, I've done stuff like that in the past. Now, looking at it, reminded me of the old stress of um, setting up a exhibition and all that. I mean, goodness knows how many all nighters I've done in the day. It reminds me of um, all of that again. Ah, well, I believe this one I went to is just about to close. So, I, uh, I've been told the family of some famous tea room along here. Yeah. Must be yes. That experience today there to go for a cuppa ended up having off chocolate like as um there was a list of like so many teas I couldn't like even think what well, uh, like flavoured teas and I've never like had flavoured tea before so um didn't quite know what to get so I ended up getting off chocolate to be honest the hot chocolate was quite nice as well I I was in what almost looked like a downstairs cinema in a and I'll turn this down just so I don't talk too loud which I probably am and then um, just so no people no um one thinks to me sod you you smoggy um, I, um, yeah I would have vlogged while I was actually in a bit better but um, it was like people about so I didn't from Newcastle now. Well, I've been home a while but I didn't and just had a half an hour lay down. Yes, it's actually the opposite way because I've um well rather than actually probably going to bed I just got my pillows and had to lay down with my clothes on. But uh, yeah after doing some of today it certainly has helped me feel better. Like, of course, I've been out all afternoon um, and having a bit of a train journey has made me feel better. But I'm so tired, I kind of feel like I've been to London for three days and got back yesterday where, like, all the tiredness catches up on you. Uh, well, anyhow, guys, thank you all for watching. Please drop a like, subscribe, and goodbye.